Hi, welcome back to Bransford Webs. It's the um, beginning of August now, the season's moving on, um, school holidays and things, so we'll have a look at a few new um, stock lines we've put on in the moment. But this week we're down here in um, part of the nursery we call Bosbury, um, right at the bottom of Bosbury. Um, and Bosbury's made up half the, half the section of the nursery is these twin span tunnels um, with good ventilation on the sides, and the other half is low tunnels, which are a combination at the moment with shade netting on for helliballs or open beds at the moment. So we're in here this week because they just put it the um, pots of perennials and pots of cover. So this is our one litre collection that we go out um, sort of mid to late February next year. And these are just being potted into these jumbo plugs from a little plug. So that's the way it's coming to us on the nursery. And then we pot it into these um, jumbo plugs. They're grown on in here until later in the autumn, sort of late September, October, when they're then potted into their final three litre, um, so one litre pots. Um, to put the final bit of growth on before they go out early next year. And the reason we do that rather than go straight, straight from a um, small plug into the one litre is just that the crown of the plant becomes much stronger. So you get when it finally goes out you get a premium one litre herbaceous plant that's going to really produce some good um, flowering growth in the first year for your customers and um, help your customers succeed in their garden. So on to this week's um, looking good list. Um, last week was a bit lean, didn't put a great deal of new products online. Um, but this week's a bit different, we've put plenty of new stuff online so I'll quickly whisk through all these and show you what's looking great this week. One thing you will notice, it moves a lot more into shrubs um, as we're going through the next few weeks. So while we're talking about shrubs, the first couple of things we've put on are our abelias. So first of all we've got a abelia kaleidoscope, two litre crop, absolutely stonking plants, loads of top growth on there and just starting to produce this late summer uh, autumn colour with this uh, nice burnt orange tinge to the new growth. So that's a Beelie Kaleidoscope with a 2 litre, an absolutely stonking plant. Um, a little bit smaller but slightly different, still a good 2 litre plant, is a Beelie Hotlis. Again you've got a more golden variegation on this, um, sort of creamy golden variegation against the green and there's a little bit of bud and flower as well on these as well. Again 2 litre plant, way more than a pot full, really nice um, to give you colour through into the autumn. Talking of autumn colour and something that's only going to get stronger and stronger now is Burberry's Admiration. I really like this plant, it's got a nice mound form in Berberis, it's got this lovely um, red new growth on it, and shows off to a green, um, makes some more shady spots, <coughs> excuse me, um, but yet it's, um, the colour just gets more and more intense and it's just got like a bush of burning bright red as we get into the autumn, so that's Berberis admiration. A couple more Berberis have gone online, I've got two here actually, but um, we've put the Berberis rockets on as well, which give you the same as the uh, admiration but just in a bit more of an upright habit, so Rather than form that nice mound, these form these nice sort of columns of bright, intense colour. So the ones we've got here, rosy and golden, we've also got red rockets as well. As I say, that's going to get stronger and stronger, more intense colours as we get through into August, late August into September, and into the autumn month too. And again, in a two litre pot. Finish on shrubby things for a moment with um, sort of Hebe Liz, which is our own um, variety. So lovely variegation, forms that lovely big purple flowers as well in the summer. But really this crop's being grown for its foliage colour and foliage interest through August and September. So that's Hebe Liz, again like all our Hebe's in a two litre pot. And then we've got some really nice one litre French lavenders on light at the moment. Check the availability list, it keeps changing sort of week by week as batches have been trimmed and flushed through and start budding up. Um, but these are a really keen price as well so just to say, have a look at the availability list just to find out where they are. And they're just starting to form budding there. On to herbaceous then. So a few nice lines on, uh, first of all the Astor Island series, um, so there's four colours in this mix, um, all nice stocky plants, all forming masses and masses of bud now, so within a week or two they're going to be just a riot of colour on the plant area. A lot of talking about Astors, we've also got our Aster de Moses, which is a three litre spec, so a bigger spec than the um, Island series, and again masses and masses of bud on there, just starting to show that colour, so again, with the weather forecast of the week ahead I think we're going to have a cracking um, short colour bite on that by next week. Um, very sort of summery autumn sort of lines now. Um, a couple of anemones have gone online, so we've put our um, anemone fantasy series on. So um, we've got Pocahontas and Cinderella online. Again, lovely two litre plants, really chunky potfuls, and the buds just starting to come out of the crown. So again, I think by next week that's going to be in flower showing colour. Uh, and then also um, from the Pretty Lady series, only one online at the moment, it doesn't really show any colour yet, but this is Pretty Lady Emily. So again, lovely two litre pot full, masses and masses of bud on there, 
and this sort of semi-double flower as well. So that's going out to garden centres now and into the next week or so. And then finally uh, for this week, oh, I'm digging out from the back of this trolley, we've got um, another one of the sedums online. So this is Frosted Fire, really does stand out from all the rest. So Sedum Carl's a great variety, lovely sort of stocky habit in the garden with um, bud and flower at the moment. And then you've got Purple Emperor online for a nice dark leaf. And this with the um, cream variegation really again stands out completely different to that and loads of bud on there too so hopefully uh, more lines going on next week um, i think we'll start looking at autumn magic next week for the week after for delivery the week after so we'll see you then and show you what's looking good on the nursery Goodbye.